Hi hello and welcome to Positivity with Crochet. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to make this beautiful strawberry keychain. It is very easy and simple tutorial. To make this strawberry keychain the materials needed are you need some yarn that is green and red i have chosen this yarn and you also need a ring a keychain ring and you need a crochet hook i have taken 2.5 mm hook make sure you take the hook that matches the thickness of your yarn and also you need a pair of scissors let's get started so before we begin please note that i'll be using us terms throughout my video now for this yarn i'll be using 3 mm hook because this yarn is thicker than my red yarn so let's begin with the slip knot insert the hook and first let's make six chains 1,2,3,4,5 and 6 after six chains we will slip stitch onto the first chain pull through and pull through so now we have made a ring so after this we will work three chains one two and three after chaining three we will work one double crochet inside the ring so to double crochet yarn over go inside the ring pull through and we have got three loops pull through first two loops and pull through the next two loops so this three chains we will consider as first one double crochet and next we have one more double crochet now chain one after chaining one two double crochet in the same ring so pull through two and pull through two one more double crochet three loops you have got pull through the first two loops and pull through the next two loops so we have done with two double crochet now we will chain one so we will repeat this again two double crochet one chain two double crochet again one one chain we have done so now two double crochet one two double crochet again chain one so now in this way we have to work throughout the round so now we have two double crochet one chain two double crochet one chain two double crochet one chain so we have got two double crochet one set two sets three sets and in between we have one chain so all together throughout this round we need 12 sets of these two double crochet and in between make sure you chain one so work throughout the round now i have done 11 sets that is two double crochet one set then this is two sets three four five six seven eight nine 
10 11 sets I have done so now it will be a little tighter so you can pull it and now this is my last set I will be working on so chain one so two more double crochet for my last set So one double crochet and one more double crochet so I have done 12 sets now chain one after chaining one you will slip stitch onto the third chain here on top of the third chain one two three here so slip stitch now I have joined this ring so after slip stitch you need to reach it to the chain one space here so to reach there you can slip stitch once to, to reach it there so yes I have reached to the chain one space now okay now I will chain one pull the yarn tight and cut the yarn off so now we have done till here now we will be working on this so grab your red yarn and now first make a slip knot now I have changed my hook I have taken 2.5 mm hook now So now insert the hook where you have made one chain space. So insert the hook there and slip stitch. Okay, let's begin now. Here, pull it tight. chain three one two three after chaining three in the same space you will work two more double crochet to double crochet insert the hook you've got three loops now pull through two and pull through two again you need one more double crochet in the same space loops pull through two pull through two now we have done three double crochet in the chain one space here so again next find the next chain space that is one chain space go in there and work three double crochet there pull through two And pull through two sorry so go directly there three double crochet so pull through two pull through two again one more double crochet pull through two pull through two pull through two so we have done Three double crochet in there now again go to the next chain space that is over here so go in there pull through two pull through two so three more double crochet here all together three double crochet so pull through two Three. so we have done with three double crochet now again go here that is the next chain space work three more double crochet so one two and three
so you will repeat throughout the round so I have reached till here and 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and this is the last set I will be working on so 3 double crochet in there so 1 2 and 3 so after this slip stitch on top of the third chain here so I have joined the ring the round so now I have I, I have reached here so I need to reach over here the next space here so to reach there I will slip stitch twice So slip stitch once and slip stitch twice so now I have reached till here so after we reach to this space now we'll work on the next round so first chain 3 and now in the same space we need to work two more double crochet so including the first three chains we have done three double crochet now in the next space here here we will work three more double crochet so one double crochet two and three after this again in the next space here you will work three more double crochet so one two and three after this go to the next space here and work three more double crochet one two and three so again next space one two and three so we have done one two three four and five sets after this you will not work on this you will instead you will skip this and go to the next here go here and work two, three double crochet in there so one double crochet two And three now you will repeat this one two three four okay four more times you will repeat this now again you will skip here because this is the last one you will skip here you will not work on this chain 
and you will join this round by slip stitch you will slip stitch onto the third chain on top of the third chain here and join this round so we have got this shape now now again you are reached here so no, now you need to reach to the next space here so to reach it there slip stitch twice so once and again in here get inside and slip stitch so finally you have reached to this space now again we'll repeat the round so chain three and now again two more double crochet in the same space so one more double crochet we need yes now go to the next space here and work three double crochet there so one two three sorry three now go to the next space one two and three again to the next space one two and three now as I said skip this chain skip the chain this one and go to the next chain here next space here this space and work three double crochet there sorry so we are done with one double crochet now two more double crochet in the same space So we have done three double crochet here now let's go to the next space and work three more double crochet there so one two sorry and three again go to the next space and work three more double crochet there so one, two, and three. So yes, you have to work one more double crochet. Sorry, three more double crochet in the next space. So one. and three now we will join this round by slip stitch so we will not work on here we will search the third here on top of the third chain one two three so on top of the third chain here we will slip stitch pull through and pull through so we have done till here now as I said we need to reach to this space okay how we did earlier so to reach there you need to slip stitch twice so once sorry. once and slip stitch twice 
okay so we have reached here so now we'll work on the next round so three chains first one two and three and two more double crochet in the same space so now let's go to the next space that is here here the very next space so work three more double crochet there one two and three now again work on the next space which is here the very next space work three more double crochet in there so one two and three so now you will leave this you will skip this skip this space and you'll go to the next the other side okay you will work three more double crochet in there so one double crochet and you need two more double crochet in the same space So we are done with three double crochet now okay now let's work on here the very next chain three more double crochet sorry very next space so one two and three so after this again here We'll work three more double crochet. So one, two, and three. So after this, skip this space. And you will slip stitch now on top of the third chain one two three so here we will go in pull through and pull through and pull through so we have done with this round so now again we need to reach to this space so slip stitch once And slip stitch twice so again now three chains for the next round one two and three after chaining three two more double crochet in the same space sorry chains two double crochet in the same space so one double crochet one more double crochet after this you will work on the next space here three more double crochet so one and three after this flip it skip this space and go to the go to the other side and work three double crochet here in this space so one Two and three again work on this space three more double crochet one two 
and 3. So now again turn to the other side and slip stitch. You will leave this space, you will not work on this space. And now you will slip stitch on top of the third chain. One, two, three. So here, sorry. Go in here, pull through, and pull through, sorry. And pull through. So you have joined this ring by slip stitch. So now, here in the middle you have to reach so slip stitch twice to reach to that space so slip stitch once and slip stitch twice so we have reached here now three chains one two and three so now here you will work two more double crochet so one double crochet and one more in the same space yes now we have done with here three now you will flip it as i said earlier you will flip it and you will not work on this space you will work on the other side that is the last space here so there work three more double crochet make sure you don't join them both so one two and three so after this we will slip stitch to the back of the first chain here so flip it so we are here just flip it and on the top of the third chain that is one two and three here we will slip stitch joined here in this way. Now chain one and secure it tight. Pull it tight and you can cut the yarn now. Okay and this, this end you can weave in or maybe you can push it inside here. Okay now let's see how to make this hanging loop okay so grab your green yarn and make a slip knot double the yarn first okay so first you make a slip knot and insert the hook and now work seven chains one two three four five six six or seven chain you can make so i have made seven chains now pull the yarn like this and pull it tight make it tight and cut the yarn off okay so now grab this piece sorry grab this piece and pull through like this and the next side do the other side also the same way insert the hook and grab this piece grab these ends sorry yes grab this and bring it in so 
so yes now so we adjust it like this on the extra yarn and now put a knot here So we have done here and you can hide these ends you can push it in or maybe you can pull it in now I have done with this loop so now let's see how to put in this keychain ring okay so grab your keychain ring so slowly insert it Yes, finally our keychain, the strawberry keychain is ready and if you like this tutorial, please do like my video and mention it in the comments below and if you have not subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel in order to get the latest video updates. Thank you for watching.